Hi, welcome to the demonstration of Android based encrypted SMS system. This is an advanced encryption and decryption system targeting the SMS for Android users, both sender and receiver. User can send an encrypted message while he can decrypt an encrypted message. The system has three main modules inbox, sent, and favorites. The system makes use of the SMS that you see in the inbox, but this system filter filters out the one which are encrypted and shows it in the personal inbox of the application. Same goes for the sent tab. The messages which are sent through this app will be shown in the sent tab. Your favorites plays an important role here. The user is allowed to save a contact as favorites while entering the contacts shared key also. So when the user receives any messages from the contacts marked as favorite are auto decrypted while others have an option to manually enter the key to decrypt every time when the user wants to read the message. The shared private key is already defined in the application and one has not to insert anything but the message is encrypted with the sender's key. So the receiver of the message should have the sender's key that is mandatory. The shared key is auto generated and cannot be changed but for the user's keys the system allows the user to save it along with the contacts details in the favorites. The login is necessary here as a single user can have multiple accounts with different IDs so that he can maintain each account for different purpose and not clubbing them. This system makes use of AES encryption algorithm to encrypt and decrypt the message. This app uses Android Studio as its front end and SQL Lite as a back end. Let's see how it works. So since I've already logged in, it will take me directly to my home page. So this is the inbox that I was talking about in the introduction. This is the send item and this is the favorite. So this is a message that I've already got from Tom saying hello bro. So this is auto decrypted. That is because I have saved his number along with the key in the favorite section. If I delete it, now if I go back to inbox, you will see the number and you will see that the, the message has been encrypted. So if I click on the message, it will ask me to decrypt it. So this is the key that I have copied to my clipboard and if I press go, it will decrypt the message. But every time I have to do the same thing to decrypt it. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to add to the favorite section here. And this is the key and add. So now if I go back to inbox, you'll see it is automatically decrypted. We have also used a broadcast receiver here. So whenever an SMS is sent and it is through this app, it will automatically show you in the notification and from another phone I'll just send an SMS okay so as you saw you are receiving two SMS's here that is one that goes to the apps inbox and another one is the notification it is saying a message is received from Tom so if I click it it will take me to the inbox and this is the new message that Tom has sent me. This is auto decrypted. For example, if I remove Tom here again, and you will see so it goes like this. Let's add Tom back. Thomas back here. So likewise I can also send an SMS. Let's say we send an SMS back to Tom. I can also select from here. It will ask me whether I want it from favorite section or contact section. I can also add from the contact section or from the favorite section. So I am adding Tom here and I am telling him thank you for the message and I will send it. So it says message is sent 
and if I go back to send here you see this is the message that I have sent him thank you for the message and this is the key so if anyone wants my key so I can just copy this to my link board and I can share with them thank you